Following the two-day warning strike led by the Nigerian Labour Congress NLC across the country to press the demand on the removal of fuel subsidy by President Bola Metinibu led government, the TUC has ordered its workers to return to work as per the NLC directives. Some of the public servants in Delta State and the chairman of Delta State NLC, Comrade Goodluck Obolukuku, who spoke to our Asaba correspondent Apumejiro, said the two unions have different directives for their workers. Obolukuku said more than 90% of Delta State civil servants belong to the NLC and all workers in the state are complying with the national directive. With the directive of the National Executive Council of the NLC, Workers in Delta State have stayed away from work so that the federal government will listen to us if they are not been listening. You must also not forget that these uh, two days is just a warning strike and it's a prelude for a total shutdown on 21st of this uh, month if the federal government fails to Listen. The request is all about the improvement of lives of Nigerians. The pains we are going through from the removal of subsidy that is making life so hard. That's why if you can see our gates here, the entire chapter of Ratawo, we are not working. So that we can form alliance with the labor to fight for what belongs to Nigerians. We are appealing to the government to do what is right because we need the pressure in Nigeria to be reduced because they know what to do and they know what is right and the labor by this process will always speak with one voice. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.